In the far Pacific, a small island holds giants of carved tuff. On Rapa Nui, hundreds of Maui rise on stone platforms called Dahu. Most face inland as guardians. Some wear redstone top knots from a separate quarry. In the crater of Rano Raraku, unfinished figures still sleep in the rock. The question is movement. How did a people with few trees carry bodies of stone across rough slopes? Clues sit on the old roads. Many statues were found fallen forward as if they pitched while moving. Their bases are beveled and slightly curved. That shape lets the statue tip and step when pulled from the sides. Teams with ropes at left and right can rock the weight. A third line steadies from behind. The figure walks inch by inch. The island paths curve and rise in ways that suit this motion. Other methods were possible. Sledges on rollers. Greased skids over packed earth. A mix may have been used as tools and routes changed. What is certain is the purpose to bring ancestors to the coast and set them where sea and village meet. Later storms and conflict toppled many figures, restorations raised some again. The giants keep their silence. The roads keep the rhythm of feet on stone. More secrets are waiting. Subscribe.